Hello everybody, my name is Bugster and welcome back to The Quarry where we're heading towards the end. I don't really know what chapter we're on. We're going to see in a second what chapter we're on uh, as it opens up here. Chapter 8, so we've still got three chapters left. I think, I think there's going to be 10 chapters. So, yeah, so we're going to see is, where is is what we Hackett? can get through. Shut up. Wow, rude. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. Caitlin, what do I do? Oh, wow. Real strong showing on the leadership front. I said shut up. <sighs> oh, no way. I am not getting involved. This is all you, buddy. Look, just think about everything that's happened tonight, okay? That's all I'll say. The body in the lake, too. Remember what Jacob said? Yeah, right. Listen to me. These people are not who you think they are, I promise. Hold up, you, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? It's the ghost story he told us about, right, Caitlin? This isn't a ghost story. It's a creature feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. Your bracelet. What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst, worst case, case scenario. Oh, you know. Brian, put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. You got a shotgun bullet of silver. I like Laura. I like her, so I don't want to shoot her. Don't want to fight. So, her. come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. Um, I just think what I know. Makes you think I know that. Uh, you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here. He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. I think that spooky house behind these woods. What spooky house? No, don't go to Dude. spooky No, 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 don't go to spooky house. No, 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 no. I was quite happy with it being in the woods. Not gonna lie, quite happy with it being in the woods. No spooky house. Um. B -b 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 I mean, I mean, we're gonna. I kind of want to kill Chris Hackett because I don't really care about him. I mean, have you thought about not killing him? Have you thought about, you know, not killing him? I'm thinking about not killing you. What? <laughs> I like her. Look, when the sun comes up, I am stuck until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? Don't forget about Nick, dude. Yeah, that's a good point. Okay, any clothes I'm going to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. Yep. I'm going with you. What? what? Uh... Yeah, what they said. Um, well, Chris clearly has something to do with it. Um, no way you go. There's on. no way I'm letting a murdering fugitive like you go anywhere near Chris on your own. Wow, are you flirting with me? What? No. Fine, do whatever you want. You saw what happened to Nick. He was bitten. Why? Why is Ryan? Everything's gonna be fine. That cop car you stole. Where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? It was a stolen cop car. You're gonna I have mean, to try and fix the point. minivan. Get somewhere safe. How long do you have? 
an hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. Wonderful. All right. Yeah. Yeah, fine. Absolutely fine. Yeah. No worries at all. Are you sure Sorry. this is the right? Are you sure this is the right way? Pretty Not sure. concerned at all. Yeah. Pretty, pretty, or definitely. What do I look like? A tour guide? I mean. You being Have there? Have you actually been there before? I mean, n no. Wait, seriously? I know as much as you do. Oh, yeah. this is this is wonderful. Going to creepy house for now. How well do you know Chris Hackett? Reason, Mr. H, pretty well. Like you're pretty sure we're going the right way. When I first came to camp, I was going through some personal shit, and Mr. H helped me sort it out. He's a good guy. You don't know him like I do. You don't know him at all. Okay, okay, jeez, teacher's pet. <laughs> Why are you like this? I should thing. ask you the same thing. What do you mean? Why are you really here? I can't let you just shoot him. I'm not going to. I'm going to shoot a werewolf, which he definitely is, is by the way. He's not. Is too. He so is. He's definitely it's a not. werewolf. Jesus. Definitely a werewolf. 100% a werewolf. No questions asked. Not even concerned about that. Creepy there house. Is. No. Creepy nope. house. No. No. Nope. So he lives in some redneck mansion with his redneck nope. family in the nope. ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there. But if we're looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. So, uh, wait, how do we get there? What do you mean? How do we get to the house? I don't know. That's a really good question. Maybe we just don't. Oh my god, can you quit? Uh, I get it, he's your friend, but come on. Look, I understand Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Sure. Yeah. Laura. Chris is a good man. This isn't about good and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, <laughs> if there's another way, I'm all for it. Hey, where are you going? You're on a timer, remember? There must be another way across somewhere. I got uh -oh. you. Uh-oh. Careful, it's gonna go. Placement. I mean, it's a good job there's water, isn't it? Holy oh, shit! Are you okay? Laura? It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Oh my god, Laura. Jesus, Mary and Jazz Hands. Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax, look. Oh, there you go. Oh! What big eyes you have, Grandma. No shit. As you can see. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Yep. Define yellow. Shit. We haven't got much time. I, 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 I. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, yeah. Loving every second of this. Do you know what? When I thought of what do I want to be doing with my time, it was taking a werewolf woman 
um, wherever she wanted to go and to kill whoever she wanted to kill and you know just makes me feel really safe and secure I'm not gonna lie I definitely feel safe and secure I've played these games too often to know that there is always something on the other side of anywhere what's this this must be part of the old working quarry one of those lunchboxes is this part of hack oh this is part of Hackett history which I'm not gonna lie I don't have much of uh, the forgotten belongings of a, qu a quarry miner abandoned in the tunnels a letter of foreclosure within indicates that this has been down here since the 1930s okay what about the police car keys Laura stole the police car to escape and ditched it in the lake. She must have left the keys on the island along with Max. That would make sense. Uh, and then the old photo, uh, Chris Hackett and T Hackett, Chris and Travis, their brothers. <laughs> Do you know what? Far too much of this is actually starting to make sense. Far too much. Uh, is there anything else that we... Oh, the Charged Sheriff's Batch. The previous sheriff was killed in the fire six years ago, so presumably this belonged to him. Travis must have succeeded him. Got ya? Uh, and then the newspaper scrap headline. The fire of Harum Scarum six years ago took the lives of many and it's rumoured to have been arson. No wonder it made the first front page. Arson will do that. It will definitely make the front page. And anything else that I'm... There's so much here that I've managed to get... Letter to the camp nurse. Uh, it makes total sense knowing he was on a time limit. Chris didn't want to risk the nurse being around when he turned into a werewolf. That would make sense. And then the office. Laura and Max were kidnapped by Travis and Chris. Um, tr by Travis and Chris tried to hide it by not reporting that they didn't show up for camp. Got you. That explains it. Sense. There's a lot going on. So much going on. Um. This is probably somewhere where you would get a tarot card or something. And I'll look like a right idiot because I won't have one. But hey ho, not much I can do. Um. Oh! What's this? Miner's gear. Right? These must have been from the quarry days. Old quarry tools. Perfect. These rusty old tools are leftovers from the Hackett's industrial heyday before the mine's foreclosure. No duh. No one's been down here for years. Y you would be surprised. Some, something's down here. I'm telling you now, 100% something's down here. So, see, th this goes up there straight, right? But this one goes along the outside. Before I saw something there, did you, did you guys see something there? At the corner of your eye? Oh, it was just, it was literally the reflection. It looked, it genuinely looked like something was like being like, oh, pick me up, pick me up, but it, it wasn't. Um, okay. For going around the long way, would have helped. But no. Going the long way's not helped at all. Genuinely, don't know why there was two methods there, other than aesthetics, but... I mean, I appreciate the aesthetics, but I'm, I'm trying to find secrets here. I want to kind of understand what the hell is going on, because apart from werewolves, I know about nothing. I don't understand why this... Did you hear that too? Um, it's her. Who? The Hag of Hackett's Hag Quarry. Of Hackett's Quarry. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. Woo! What has the hag got to do with anything? Oh, shit! Oh. 
Has anyone heard that? No, they can't have done. This place is not up to code. Really? I mean, if the code is literally crumbling to the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Yeah. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. They are flirting a little bit, aren't they? I'm getting that vibe. Are you getting that vibe? Because I'm definitely getting that vibe. Aha! The lovers. Oh, the lovers. Is, that's never a good... That's never a good sign, is it? Just look at this place. At least I got one. So I don't have to worry about the old woman anymore. So positive. Oh. Oh. Yeah. That's fine. Aha. Yeah, they're most definitely flirting. I could really do with a hamburger right about now. Stop being weird. Quite weird that she's flirting with him. I, I, I mean, to be fair, she hasn't had a proper boyfriend in a, a while, so does kind of make sense. Does make a lot of sense. Uh, oh what? boy, this is I. Whoa. You're scared. Okay, I'll stop. Do you think actually something is in here with us? Either that or this route isn't as disused as we thought. Oh, wonderful. Uh, evidence, because I missed the scarred flesh. Scarred flesh is actually part of the final evidence. A lump of what appears to be damaged scarred flesh. See, I don't get how these evidences link together, really. Um, apart from the fact that it's proven that werewolves exist. But, God knows. Okay, so the scarred flesh is important, then. Interesting. They're definitely not alone. Something else is here, but I don't know what. A long way down. I mean, it would make se a long way down. Oh, brilliant. So something's falling down then. But maybe Chris Hackett's here. I mean, they're hiding somebody, I reckon, to keep him safe. Well, where's K out? <laughs> Look who's finding their funny bone. <laughs> So what's your deal then? What do you mean? Uh, the whole mysterious brooding loner thing, it doesn't quite fit with the I love my camp leader vibe. <laughs> so I don't fit into the right box, is that what you're saying? Well, pretty much. And what box would that be? Nothing, forget it. Do you always do that? Do what? Uh, start to engage in a conversation and then just immediately recoil into your shell. Maybe I don't want to talk to you anymore. Oh, wow, charming. <laughs> I am assuming you're single? Yeah, why? No reason. This way, I see a light. Yeah. Yeah, I don't like that. Or you can just hang out here, up to you. Someone's been eating their spinach. <laughs> so, you want to go into the collapsing nightmare tunnel first, or shall I? I mean... I don't want to go in it at all. 
Wheel of Fortune. Oh, no, I found two tarot cards. I have to choose. Don't make me choose. Why, oh, why is this game such a dick at times? Why is it so it's promising? Mean? I don't like this. I'm on edge. Like, really on edge. You know when you think of things that make people feel on edge? Currently, think of one of the things that would be very high up that list. And then, that's how I feel. So I am very on edge. I do not want to be here. Just the moonshine. Okay, it lagged there. Why did it lag there? Rather you not like in certain places, not gonna lie. Is that a doorway, I'm presuming? Oh, you know. Careful. Splinters. Thanks. I'm fine. Guess we found the party. Alcohol. From Prohibition. These are run running tunnels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Probably still good. Good. Ah. Try vintage. Well, I guess the hackets were bootleggers. That makes sense. I guess when the core shut down, they branched out. Yeah. Come on, time travel later. Interesting. So many interesting things. You think this is it? Nope. Uh, beach me. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> I, I. Yeah, me too. I really hope it's not it. To be honest. Shall we? I don't want to be here. <laughs> I, I, my heart is racing right now. I just think someone's going to die in this episode. I really do. Like with, three ep with three chapters left, it's def I'm definitely not finishing it today. But in this episode. But Jesus, I am. I just have a feeling someone's going to die. Someone's going to die in this one. It's really laggy. I really do apologize. But I've. Uh, it's really laggy. What? Kind of my bad. Had a bit of a tumble with one of the locals. The fuck, Caitlin? This place is wrecked. <laughs> well, you should see the other guy. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Not a clue. Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean, should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. And then we can come back for them. Yeah. And Nick. And Nick. Who's now a werewolf. And will probably die because I'll probably accidentally shoot him out of pure panic, so. You know. Oh. Wait. What? The chariot thing. Is there. Is there something in there? I don't know. What is it? I... Jacob? Emma? I don't know. Are they... Should I open it up? No. Your funeral, buddy. Oh, oh my she god. Me. She hates me! Hey, hey, it's us! Oh, oh shit. It burns! Oh my god. I mean, fair play to Emma. I'm Wait. so sorry. 
Dylan, I am so, so sorry. Oh, I didn't know it was you. I was really Dylan. scared, and I thought... It's not Mace. What? Air freshener. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's been over dramatic. It's find in the van. It worked. I mean, it definitely worked. I thought I was going to get a choice there. Uh, Dylan, <laughs> you're, uh... Yeah, his hand's been cut off. So she was in the police station this whole time? Insane, right? This whole time, we were having such a fun summer. You never knew. Jeez. Yep. Okay. Can you fix it? No. Oh. Not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. So you can fix it? Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're gonna find it. That sounds like a long shot. It is a bit of a long shot. Dylan, come on. Look, I need you. We need you. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. What exactly are we supposed to do? I mean, the van is nice, but it's not exactly Fort Knox. Well, there's a shelter under the lodge. You could be safe there for a while. Uh oh. All right. No. Nope. Abby, you're with me. No. Nope. Good luck. No. Nope. No. Nope. Nope. No. 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 What? What? I didn't choose anything. I would like to point out I did not choose anything. Is there anything I have chosen there? It literally told me if I've chosen. I have chosen nothing. Literally nothing. What did I choose? <laughs> what could I have possibly chosen? What? <laughs> Oh, I mean, maybe the fact that Dylan went with me? Um, that looks more like where Thingy is. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe we we're about to go into the big cage Thingy. What was that? Huh? What was that? What was that? Oh, it's nothing. We got we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. How oh, fun. Right. Cool. Keep it down. You keep it down. Shh. I hate this. Oh, fuck that. I, that's about the third tarot card. Clue. The rum still. What, what, what clue is that? To the hack history. An antique rum still likely in, from the prohibition days. A relic of the Hackett family's past. Why does that matter? Why does the Hackett history matter? I'm not going to lie. Why in the world does that matter right now? This is an old still. I guess business was booming. Was. Nope. I know what's in there. So we're going to go the long way round. Just so we get a few more clues. You get me? That's the fourth tarot card. That's given me so many tarot cards.
Huh. Jeez. Poor kid. Head this big. <laughs> Bobby. Who's Bobby? Bobby Hackett. I'm not okay. I'm not okay. It's coming from a bed. Well, they got them caged, so. Check up. Ryan. Jesus, what happened to you? Nope. Hey, bad idea. Yep. Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay. Um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. Okay. I hate this. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. <sighs> What's going on, my child? Uh, it's Kaylee. She's dead. <laughs> no. Yeah. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got to screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. Uh-huh. No. Yeah. No, 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 not my granddaughter, not my only granddaughter, oh not my, my Kaylee, God. not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, not my little Kaylee, you goddamn piece of shit, not my little Kaylee, God damn you, oh dear. what did you do to her, she's unhinged, Did you get bitten? Is she crazy? Don't stop, Laura. Laura. What have you done? <laughs> oh god, I actually have killed someone. Oh God! Sure that shit doesn't bite. Oh no! Beauty is inside her. Oh no! That's why I need to find the key tonight. Oh, I've actually mucked up. When oh. I say yes, you say no. Oh, I've actually mucked up. She just killed Nick, didn't she? She just killed Nick, didn't she? Oh, balls. Welcome back. Did you miss me? Why wasn't that my warning from the tarot card? Hopefully, you've bought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? I'm... I'm not impressed. I am so angry. 
so angry with myself. Oh, I don't the even want to Empress. listen to her. Look at her. her. <laughs> Those at the top can <sighs> fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you. <laughs> but it's no less than she deserves. Oh. The lovers. There's harmony in disagreement. Brought to light only by sparks of passion. I'm so angry. <laughs> Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone's life. The Wheel of Fortune. After uh. all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works it. in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the wheel spins, the eagle eye can tell where it's going to stop. The Emperor. The Emperor. Authority, paternity, stricter, is designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall, and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. For me, it's sort of a weird Details. fortune. Yeah, Seymour. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. Um, it's either lovers or wheel of fortune for me. I think lovers. Did you hear that whisper? Because I heard the whisper. So. Go. You still got time. Be careful now. Be very careful. So you've got to let her bite you. Why? Why have you got to do that? Why would you have to let her bite you? I am so baffled. Have you been there before? The scrapyard? Nah. Just seen the sign on my way to camp. Matriarch. <sighs> Jesus. I think I might have just killed Nick. I'm hoping the electrified fence stopped it, but... What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up. So basically, <laughs> it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest whatever? Yeah. Yep. What was that? I don't know. Let's just keep moving. Okay. So, I guess this is me now. What? You're you gotta look great with a hook. We can call you Hooky McHookface. <laughs> That's quite funny. Yeah, I guess it's pretty unique. I could get different attachments for it. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> Lean into it. One hell of a story, too. Yeah, I guess it's something to talk about on the radio station. We're all going to be laughing about this in a few years. You, me, maybe even Ryan. Uh... Kind of got close at the fire pit. Back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? It's always next year, right? <laughs> well, let's get through this year first. Don't pan over. I don't want to know. Really matter anyway. It looks like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident. And heroic. With an eye patch. So pirates. 
Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> there. Please just let them do well and just... Oh, shit. Relax. It's a motion sensor. We're okay. I think. I hope so. Oh, look. So Steampunk's back in. Ew. Come on. This way. I don't, I don't want anyone to die. No no more death. No more death. No more death. I've been, I've been heartbroken by the one possible death there is. Abigail. Oh, the storm shower. So what's in the storm shower? Chris? Who's Ian as well? Oh, they're in the storm shower. So what do we do now? Well, well... Live up some cocktails, see what's on the TV. <laughs> no? Um, why are you so positive? Why are you always so positive? Oh, why do you keep asking me that? Uh, I asked you about your confidence, not your whatever is happening right now. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I guess I just don't like to see other people sad. Is that why you do your videos? Is that why you do the internet video thingy? Internet video thingy? <laughs> Whatever it is you call it. You know, people think influencers do it just for the attention, and maybe you do at first, but after a while, it's like, what's the difference between 4,000 rando likes and 100,000 rando likes? But I make people laugh. <laughs> I act dumb and they laugh. Maybe that makes I... me dumb, or maybe I just like to make people laugh. Hmm. There's nothing wrong with that. I mean, clowns do make <sighs> a living, so... Fuck this night, <laughs> What's huh? What's the difference? Yeah. Come on. I want to hear you say it. Fuck this night. Fuck it all the way to morning. <laughs> <laughs> Does that mean they're safe? <laughs> I'm too safe now. <laughs> Can they just be safe? <laughs> oh, we're back with Laura. Okay. Okay, we're back with Laura. Put me down! Blow your fucking head up! Ah, bitch! Oh, Everybody fun. just relax. Can't shoot what you can't see, darling. Oh my god, that's... That, th this is like a horror film. Gotcha. You'll pay for what you did to my Kaylee. Get the fuck off me! Oh my god, I just blew her face off. Everybody stop! Oh my god, I actually blew her face off. Constant. What the fuck is going on up here? Uh, wake up. Wake up. I just blew her face off. Wake up. Wake up. I just blew her face off. Oh. She's gone. Little Bobby. Mom's gone. Cool. Yeah. Oh God. No more pressure. No more protecting anyone. Travis. Oh God, I've actually mucked it up. I thought I was gonna die. I thought I was gonna die, so I, I could put. Uh, oh, why am I getting stabbed? Jesus! Oh! 
Let her bite you so it heals your wounds. That makes sense. Okay, right, so it's all gone to shit. Um... really not good that's really no 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 leave it in leave it in I, I that's that's a trick that i learned is you bleed out quicker if you actually pull it out whereas if you leave it in it's it, it's not it might be severing some sort of artery at least then it's not fully severed and it will only bleed out slowly rather than quickly when it gets pulled out i'm pretty sure that's the case if it is, then that's a genius move. I really hope it is too. Okay, what's this? I can't believe that it actually just killed us straight up. She's barely been around. That woman had literally barely been in the in the in the game. Kaylee's letter. What does Kaylee's letter say? Please don't be heartbreaking. Kaylee's letter of confession addressed to her grandmother. Oh. I'm guessing she bit someone, maybe. Death. As a tarot card. Well, I'm not gonna lie, it seems a pretty useful tarot card. Why? Why is it empty? Light's shining over there, so I had a feeling that would happen. <coughs> oh, that's fun. Maybe it was a case of I would have died if I didn't do that. And maybe the two stories are either I die as Laura or this happens. Bobby's coming. Fight. Cabinet or under bed? Under bed? I think in cabinet I would have. Just can't defend. Wonderful. I do not like this. I do not like this. Okay. 
I literally left it until like the final second. I'm close. Stand by. Over. That's kind of true. I mean, you know, it's going to be hard to hide from somebody in their own house, but I mean, I'm sure as hell going to give it a try. I'd be stupid not to. Is it like a, tra a chain thing, though, where if they all bite each other, like, I, I mean, just keep running. No one's chasing it. Should I really be playing the piano? No, don't play the piano. That would be stupid, right? To play the piano. There are bears around here. Trophy hunting wall. This is messed up. The spoils of the Hackett's hunting pr prowess, you'd think they'd want to cover up the bullet wounds and signs of injury. Perhaps they serve as a reminder that these animals are definitely dead. They are so, such lovely people. Genuinely, genuinely lovely people. tree by the looks of it. It is the Hackett family tree. So the Hackett uh, family has been around for quite some time, their roots running deep in the local area. Interesting. Yep, Kaylee and Caleb at the bottom. I mean, at least, I mean, it's the constellation. She didn't have to deal with the death of her granddaughter for very long, did she? She only had to deal with it for a little bit. So, if anything, I think it's charity work. £5,000? To what? What's that £5,000 to? Show text. These cages should hold Chris, Caleb and Kaylee. When camp's over, they can keep hunting the white wolf. He's got to come back sooner or later. It'll be safe if we, we use blood. Last thing we need is more casualties. White wolf. Is the white wolf the thing that started the thing? So it started everything, maybe? 
If so, who's the white wolf? This isn't scary at all. I'm glad we found more tarot cards. Really, I don't care what tarot cards I find, because I'll be using the death one for definite, because death is avoiding a death or finding it something to. Hag. Yeah. Do you know what? I love the hack the hag and packet to Chloe. I think I think she's brilliant. Genuinely think she's brilliant. Oh. How do you do it? Oh hi. We ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. Oh my god. You know something? I ain't got enough silver to kill you. But I sure to hell can make you suffer. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna try and avoid these as much as possible. I, I, I'm not gonna lie, I don't like this guy. I like Bobby. I think mean, Bobby's nice. I just don't like this one. This one's not been a fan of us since the start. Do you know what? Run. That's not good. Oh wait, is it good? Holy Mary, Mother of God. I actually did it. Holy hell. I made the right decision. How in the world did I make the right decision? Oh, come on, Travis. Shoot her. Take her face off. You know what she did to Kaylee? And she killed your mother, too. Wait! She ran. It was the right thing to do. Holy how I actually made the right decision. So I was panicking at the fact that I killed Nick. And she said, don't believe everything you hear. Well, I promise you that. Holy how. That's huge. That is genuinely huge. I can't believe I actually managed that. By complete accident as well. I was just like, please don't do anything stupid. You know. And instead she shot him. And it, I think it... I don't I don't know if it would be Chris or the other one. Um I do can't remember the other kid's name. Clever. Clever. Okay. So 
all about holding this now. When it's safe. No idea when it will be safe. Once it starts walking away from that bloody wall, probably. first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. <laughs> Ow! You stabbed me! Yeah, fucking hurts, don't it? I ain't never been stabbed before. <sighs> Leave me alone. <sighs> Ow, it really hurts. Dad! It works. Hey, 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 it's me, it's me. What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, Ryan. Oh, how bad is it? Where are you about? So sorry. <sighs> that bad, huh? I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max, how are you? <sighs> it's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. I shouldn't have let you come. Uh, -oh. uh, you're not the boss of me. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> it's actually quite a cute moment. Am I dying? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? Wait. Maybe it yeah, here we maybe go. it will. What? Ryan, if you let me bite you. What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected. Which means Which means it will heal. Yeah. Yeah. But it also means... Yeah, yeah, I got it, Big Bad Wolf. Yep. <sighs> Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then... Then I have to kill Chris. It's, it's not killing Chris, it's killing a werewolf. Uh... It's saving your own life. And mine. And Max's and your friends, too. Yeah. Let mm -hmm. you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah. Bite, bite, it's your bite, call. bite, bite, For bite, now. bite, 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 bite. <laughs> so we doing this or no? Yeah. I'm pretty sure, right? Yeah, fucking bite, 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 bite. <laughs> yeah, why not? Why not? Stuff it. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Everyone's gonna die. Everyone's gonna die. <laughs> Everyone's gonna die. 
Oh, everyone's actually gonna die, aren't they? Nice and tender for you. <clears throat> yep. Don't pull away. Hoping that works. You should start to feel better soon, I guess. Yep. Fuck. We gotta go. What? Uh, we got it. There we go. In fairness, she's a nice person. I like her. I like Laura. Ryan was being a bit of a douchebag earlier, but Laura seems to have softened him up a little bit, which, I mean, for my own sanity, was actually quite nice. This has been a very tense episode, hasn't it? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. I'm really, really tense. Constantly. I don't think it's going to let up either. What's this white wolf that they keep going on about? This guy's never throw anything out, huh? So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, I don't know. most of these cars look like they've already been stripped. So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped apart. It's just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, no. so we're looking for engines. Engines? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. I just want to show you something. Where on the camp thing is if I go all the way down here to the Hackett house, there's Laura, Nick, and Ryan. Um, Nick looks to have had have a dead thing on him. So, not great. Um, for whatever reason, I don't get why it's not showing the other one. Um, but, yeah, I think, I think, I think Nick is dead. So, I think I did actually kill Nick. Uh, but I think I might have killed Nick to save the other one. I don't really know, to be honest. Um, yeah. I, I think... The other one might have gotten bitten but wouldn't have died and then everyone would have been infected and then it's all about saving the white wolf. I don't really know what situation we're in right now, but I think Nick's probably dead. So, whoopsie. Um, let's just hope that no one else dies during this. Looks like we got our work cut out for us, huh? Try not to make too much noise. Oh. Oh, sorry. Anything by you? Not yet. Keep looking. It seems like the hag was trying not to kill him, though. Right or left? Um, I'm right handed, so maybe this side? Oh, I hate you so much, motion sensors. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Uh. 
problem. Ugh, fuck sticks. I mean, there must be a way to open it. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe in that house thing. Yeah, Let's maybe. Take a look. Maybe. I mean, also, checking around everywhere for possible other clues of things that we might need to know. Fortunately, there seems to be no clues about anything at the moment. So... That definitely seems like a button. I don't want to press buttons without, you know, exploring areas first, preferably. I swear to God, if you get in my way one more time. Yep. Okay. Finding clues out here. August. Full moon. These sons of bitches had it all planned out. Oh yeah, well, they kind of know the situation. So, scrapyard notes. Okay, this scrawled request to keep something off the books is a little dodgy to say the least. There must be something here they don't want anyone to know about. SUV body damage, keep this off the books and out the way. Travis. Interesting. Who's T? Travis. Looks like these guys were cooking the books a little. <laughs> Dodgy. You said it. Nice. Cool. So we find a little bit out at least. Press the button and let me know. Push the button. Woo! Not daunting <sighs> at all. How are we gonna end up in a documentary? Yeah. No! Shut up, Come on, let's go. Hey, the fact that the lights keep turning on and off. Oh my god, that's going to be used as a horror element. Isn't it? Oh, it's going to be used as a horror element because you're going to see the lights go on and off everywhere. Oh, this is actually genius, but I also absolutely hate it. Hunted by literal monsters, and this is what bothers you? Yep. Yeah, both yeah. are. Yeah, both are bad. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. It, it, I'm feeling it's that same. I 
just minion and one different paths. All of which are kind of pointless. Discarded signage. Isn't this from the freak show? Yeah. The torn and broken remains of the old side show attractions, the way they they're intertwined with the rest of the scrap shows they've been sitting here for a long time. Freak show fire. What's this? Aram scare. Seen this, Caitlin? Yep. That's the woman I keep going to. Eliza the fortune teller. That's the woman I keep going to, isn't it? Interesting. intact. Hey! Why well, didn't just take that car? <laughs> Although, to be fair, the camper van does have all their stuff in it. So, I do kind of get that. I wonder what happens if no one actually dies and they just all turn back into people the next day. And they're just all werewolves. <laughs> so, apart from if they get shot with a silver bullet, they can't really die-die, right? So. So, you ever operated a crane before? I actually used to be pretty, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. No, no, uh-uh. Oh, I hear that, yeah. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so I can take a look under the hood? Right, that sounds smart. Can I have the gun or watch my back? I think she's more dan in danger. Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um, just uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. I mean, she's in more danger, but... You're going to do the past chosen thing again, and that's going to scare me. All right. Looks like somebody's mom... Never taught them how to clean up after themselves. Oh, he's also got okay, one hand there. Let's see what we're working with. All right, not too complicated. Welcome back, grabber. Now you're falling away. Will you what the hell is going on? My bad. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. All right. Here goes nothing. Yeah. You did it! Yeah, uh, I think I found my calling. <laughs> About time! <laughs> well, maybe we can see if we can try and get this thing running. <gasps> Score! Here we go. Oh, no. There we 
go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm not having anyone else die today. No one else is dying in this episode. Drop it. No. Ow. I don't feel calm. I don't feel calm. I don't feel calm. I know. I know it's telling me to feel calm. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life, for realsies. Yeah, you know, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me in the movie about how brave I am. <laughs> don't push it. Okay. So. So much for our brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? <laughs> Better than being out in the open. Come on. So I'm guessing the car's busted then? And that is where we're gonna end things. That is it for the quarry. I know I haven't reached the end of chapter 9 yet but I'm going to do the end of chapter 9 and all of chapter 10 in the same episode because quite frankly number one I don't have the time today and number two it's a lot more fun to play the ending in full and not having to stop at any point so this is it for this episode this is the penultimate episode of the quarry part 7 will be the final episode this has been genuinely really enjoyable I think Nick is dead from everything that I know um I don't know if that was the right decision, wrong decision. Not Dylan is dead. Nick, yeah, Nick is dead. Um, I don't really know. Um, but I think he is. And if so, then I've only lost one and that's not too bad. But I've got to keep everyone else alive. That includes Laura and Ryan and their little romance thing. I actually quite like it. Um, initially, I was a bit weirded out by it, but I really like it. Um, but yeah, that's the end of the episode. Make sure to that like if you have enjoyed it. Comment your thoughts to this episode down below and who you think is going to die in the final episode because i really don't know and subscribe if you're new here and so you do not miss the finale and i shall see all of you in the next video see ya <sighs> i'm a bit disappointed that i killed nick but i think i might be able to save everyone else